such a shame to leave now, right? In the time I'm so lucky. I know. I can totally cross locks. Hello and welcome to the Narbo Experience. Today we're going on a journey with Jono to Droitwich Spa. Yay, Jono helped us. Helped, helped, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we did. He did some helping um, for us to get onto the Severn and to get down here to the Droitwich Barge Canal. And today we are heading towards Droitwich Spa itself. It was a really, really nice day um, to travel down the River Severn. It was lovely and calm. It was like a mill pond. Yeah. And there were only, uh, there was one big lock to go through. And there was only one hooligan on the river it yeah it kept ramming into us yeah like yeah, was, ducking and waving it was, it was terrible i really like um going in parallel down rivers with other people and it was a new experience for these yeah. two yeah so it was just really it was a really lovely day yeah. and we've moored up in a fantastic location and, yes. and off we go today yeah so join us with jono and the narrow boat experience and now we don't know how to end this <laughs> We cast off from our little mooring just before Bridge 5 on the Droitwich Barge Canal. It's a short walk to the lock, so not worth me even getting on board lazy days. We have five locks to complete today before we finish the day in Netherwich Basin. We've left ourselves about three hours for this journey because the weather and company are too good to rush. That's on mooring and Jono is going to help her. And I have Molly, the dog, as company, which is awesome because Molly loves, loves everything. So Molly and I are best friends now. I asked her to sit there while I did the whole lock. And even when Jono came back to his boat, um, when his boat came in and he came and helped and then went back on his boat, she still didn't even move, so she got a pat for that. She's very, very obedient. He's so adorable. Where did you start? being super obedient and adorable. The first lock she cried when Jono left and this time, good girl, she just waited and she was fine. There's no crying this time but I might tell Jono there was anyway because he was so happy last time. Free. 
Droitwich Barge Canal is one of two canals into Droitwich. It makes up the Mid Worcestershire Ring and it also takes into account, that ring takes into account the Severn and also the Worcester and Birmingham Canal. We're not doing the whole ring, but that is definitely one that this part of the ring that we've traveled in the last little while has definitely been beautiful and not very busy at all. It is the beginning of autumn, end of summer. The days have been perfect and um, there's a little bit of rain forecast in our future, but then um, we're just gonna moor up for a couple of days and get some work done. Jono would often arrive at the lock before us, moor up with the centre line and start to empty the lock. Molly would, of course, supervise. The great thing about travelling together is we all got to swap over and share the locks. Mind your step, Kath. Tell us where he's mooring. Yeah, and he raced out of that last lot, like like it was on fire. <laughs> Is it something we said? <laughs> Just kidding. We are still following each other. We're still best friends. For now. Yeah. Well, I'm his best friend, but he's my second best friend. Is that because Molly's your best friend? You're my best friend. What about all your other best friends? Yeah, and Karen. <laughs> and Mandy and Louie. And Cece. Cece would be relieved not to be my best friend. <laughs> He'll be like, thank goodness. Oh, a caution sign, your favorite. My ca a caution sign in eight sized font. I'll show you. I can read the word caution. something you might be interested in. Uh, we're not 100% sure where to get these audio tours from so if you are from the area please leave us a comment below so we know where we could actually grab the audio tour from. So what happens if you don't regularly look after your swing bridges? You get overcome with weeds. <laughs> like all of Droitwich Barge Canal. The weedy canal. Put that on a t-shirt. They're reeds. They're reeds. Yeah. And they probably, most definitely, house a lot of wildlife 
and also um, do a good job in helping filtrate the water system. And maintain the quality of the banks. Yeah, so we're not complaining. Well, we are, but you know, we understand the benefit as well. Jono in the distance on the right. It would be rude not to moor up right next to him, wouldn't it? How will the cats ever become best friends with Molly if we don't at least keep them close to each other? We hope you've enjoyed our journey with Jono into Droitwich Spa. Next week we begin a crazy competition to see who can do the most cheating, I mean locks, in a day. Click the subscribe button now so that you don't miss out. Thanks for watching. Every time you do a lock you get a point. But it's not 100% fair for Jono because he can't do a whole lock because he doesn't have very much energy. <gasps> <laughs> and there's not two of me and I haven't, and I, I haven't trained Hold Molly on. up to do locks yet. I did two and a half and you did two and a half. But <laughs> if they haven't brought a windlass off the boat, why are they off the boat? Looks like I'm winning. Molly is as usual driving the boat. <laughs>